This is not where I'm supposed to go. Okay. You know what? Let's explore this a little bit more. Let's just try and hit the perfect pixel here so I can get off. Nice. Okay. Right. Let's cut through here. Kill all these copies. There was some health up here, so... Maybe something... Oh, maybe some, um, something changed. I lost my word in here. Die. Take my fate taser. go back into the upper level of uh, the aerodome, which means I cannot connect with or regroup with Lex and Tim that way where we came from, so I need to find another way, I guess. Because, as we just saw earlier, the door is closed. Let's get this health. What if I go all the way down there? To the right. Maybe there is another way I don't even know about. I haven't really explored this place too much. What's over here? What if I jump down in there? Is that death? It might be that death. I don't want to risk it. Okay, that's gonna be a hoot and a half down here because this place is riddled with dinosaurs. The spitty ones. You know those games you'd love to play, but you just hate to play them? <laughs> right? You know what I'm saying? You just want to play the game because it's awesome, but then there's repetition, and you don't make any progress. And you just start loathing. Losing. Well, your soul gets crushed, really. <laughs> That's what I'm feeling today. I haven't been feeling it with this game yet, but today I kind of feel that way. I don't know why, and it kind of bugs me because I do like the game. This Dilophosaurus and this one over there. <laughs> hey. Yes, okay, good. What's down here? I'm stuck here. Why is that a thing? Okay. You want the nostalgia, but quickly remember how frustrating it can be. Absolutely. These old games are have been kicking my butt. Remember the Lion King? At least there we had safe states, which I didn't want to use too much, and I don't think I did. Maybe at the very end. Ooh, there's a fence here. Maybe that's something. Progress. Ooh, yes. Yes, with me, everybody. Yes. There we go. I completely forgot about this place here. We're out. Sweet. Let's have a sip of our Red Bull. Not sponsored. I wish. <laughs> All right. Now, uh, what's up here? Oh, crap. Just shoot them. I hate that I can shoot the spit with this gun. Why would I be able to shoot the spit? I'd have to be a perfect shot for this. That's not the case with the taser. <laughs> I do love the sound and the, the soundtrack of this game. That's really well done. And I think of all the uh, classic Jurassic Park games we've played, this is by far my favorite. I'm just unsure if it's the nostalgia or if it's just a better game, but I feel like it's a better game overall. Where am I here? This must be back where we're at the very first level where a, uh, well, not the very first, but where we left. The Lex and Tim. Maybe I should jump down here. The only question I have is, do I jump down on the south side of this ridge or 
on the north side here. What, uh... What should I do? I think I can come around anyway, so let's go down here. I hope it didn't get a password, because I didn't write it down. I hate getting stuck here, though. And there's an invisible wall. We already established that this game might be the very source of all invisible walls that came later in games. Speaking of invisible walls, you know what really bugged me in Horizon Forbidden West, the sequel to uh, Zero Dawn? That there were invisible walls there. That's kind of... Uh, beneath the game of that quality, right? Wouldn't you agree? They could have come up with a better explanation as to why you can't go certain places yet, even though it's open world. But just an invisible wall where you can't pass over, that's kind of the easy way out. I don't think it was that much the case in the first game, uh, Zero Dawn. I hear ya. Where are you? Show your face so I can blast it. <laughs> Ooh, there's two of them. Get blasted. Nice. The blasting is real. Shoot them all. I think I need to head north, uh, west here. Ooh, completely missed the guy. <laughs> there's a thing up here. How do I get up there? Let's see if I can get up there, actually. Uh, okay, I see what, I, what needs to be done here. Not that big a mystery. Why is this game so hard? It's a good question. I think those old games were kind of uh, afraid of missing out on money. Because... You used to be able, I mean, you still are, but back in the day, you used to be able to just borrow games, right, from stores and whatnot. Rent them, that's the word I'm looking for. And uh, obviously the rent duration was a week or two weeks, and there was no way in hell you could play this game in two weeks, so you'd come back and come back and come back and rent it again, or purchase it in the end, just to be able to finish it. So I think that's the thinking there. No messages waiting. Uh, Adduct systems, what can we do here? Fence gate. Unlock. Unlocked. Nice. So all we need to do now is find Lex and uh, Tim. Let's come back down here and see where it goes. That's how I played Earthbound initially. Oh, I see, okay, so my theory's right. <laughs> Spending weeks and weeks playing it in bits and pieces. Right. I mean, that's just my theory, but I know for a fact that uh, that figured into the development of Disney's The Lion King for the Super Nintendo. They wanted you to buy the game. So they make their full buck. Their full money on the game instead of not much. <laughs> From rentals and whatnot. But I'm thinking it extends to this game as well. Uh, what's up top? Forces people to buy the guide. Right. That's a point I made very early in playing this game, that they must have made more money off guides and stuff than off the actual game. <laughs> Especially for the uh, Super Nintendo version of the Jurassic Park game we played. 
where you have to also get the key cards and whatnot and have to go back and forth through all the bunkers. Okay, let's not get lost on the... Whoa, look at this mess. I'm very close to dying here. Go. Wow, there's a ammunition here, but I can't get it because there's an invisible wall. They just really want to kill you here. That's kind of poopy. Do not appreciate being tricked by games. I don't mind a challenge, but getting tricked into getting killed, that's... That's not good. It's not a good look. <laughs> Maybe I'm just... Look at this, I can't go down there. Okay. So we're back here now. Ouch. Screw you. Where's, uh, health? Would be good. I think we're getting back to Tim and Lex now. This looks very familiar. There they are. Awesome. Yes. What? Oh, look at this. This is awesome. Password. There's a uh, Hammond. And even uh, Ellie is here. Ellie Sattler and Tim. We must power down the computer system to uh, reset it and bring Jurassic Park back online. Is that a good idea? Says Ellie. Hammond is our only option. The computer system has rebooted. We have control of Jurassic Park. You never had control. That's the illusion. Then why are the lights still off? Says, says I. Hmm. The main power circuit breakers must have been tripped. Ellen, could you restore power at the something? John and I will guide you with the walkie-talkies, says Ellie. Okay. Good. Nice. Can I shoot them? <laughs> uh, I, f I do. I, I read in the manual that I can look up and down. Uh, I haven't figured out the keys yet, so I'm going to try here. Give me a second as I probably reset the game or something. Okay, that's left and right looking. I don't care about that too much. What is that? Ooh, we get a map. That doesn't bode well. That means we're gonna have to do mazes. Just wanna figure out how I can look up and down. It's going forward. We're gonna have it in a second here. Only a couple of keys left on my keyboard. Aha! There's no up and down. That's kind of weird. Oh, there it was. Okay, that's down. What's up? Oh, one and two is up. This is so awkward. And space is shooting. Can I sh shoot those guys? They're invincible. Let's get a closer look at them. What? Okay, there's Lex. There's Tim. There's Ellie. Whoops. That was kind of awkward looking down on her. <laughs> Didn't mean to do that. There's Hammond. He's really... They spared no expense on this game. Awesome. I like this. How did I reset the view with three? Okay. That was really awkward just going up to her and going like... Hmm, let's see here. Alright, uh, reset and go. So anybody remember what our mission is? We need to break the circuit breakers or something. What is this place anyway? Is this the visitor center? Okay, I think we need to get out of here. There we are. Alright, cool. So we haven't seen the famous 3D Velociraptors yet. So I'm thinking that's what's coming up. Is there a lean in this game, like in Return to Castle of Wolfenstein, where you just can glimpse around the corners without getting noticed? That would be sweet, because I'm scared. What was that? <laughs> okay. No, 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 don't open up the door. I'm not ready. 
Okay, we could go through here. What is that? The kitchen? Um, alright. There's something red in the corner over there. This is tense. Are those eyes, or is that just a computer terminal? Okay, it's just computers. It's nice. And there's another door. Oh, Ooh, bad news, Ellen. It seems the raptors have escaped and entered the building. Be careful, you may have company. Crap. Had to go down south at some point. Can I not shoot this? Don't want to die trying, but I want to try anyway. Okay, I don't know how the crosshair thing works, or if there even is a crosshair. Oh, sorry, there's a fruit fly or something. Get lost. Having trouble playing this game as it is. <laughs> Don't chew in my face. Or is it a moth? It might be a moth. Let's hope they haven't figured out how to open doors. What is this? This should be shootable, no? Hmm. Doesn't do much. Okay, I think I circled around this place, so there's a door here, and I think there's another door over here. I have no idea where I'm supposed to go, so let's just keep right. From here on out, anyway. <laughs> Because I didn't start off going right all the time. Ooh, help. Found some first aid. Okay. Good for me. What did I find here? We found some ammo. Okay, even better. That was just a supply room, it seems like. That's good. So, if I keep going right, we should come up to the next door. That's a big red sign over there. Oh, it's Jurassic Park, okay. I think it's dead. Whoa. <laughs> Those things jump right at you. Does that mean I'm on the right track, or... Is it just... Something. What is this supposed to be? Huh. I couldn't tell you. It was a terrifying sound, totally. I do like that they have most of the sounds out of the movie, actually. Dennis Nedry scream when Alan dies. Still. Okay, I think it takes like two shots to kill them, which is good. Just gonna sp spam the space bar. Let's watch our health here. every second of that. That was cheating. <laughs> danger. Why is there a danger sign here? Ooh. Ammo. Found some ammo. Good. Alan, the computer indicates activity up ahead. Take care. 